Now to our first alert update in Brown County. Action 2 News has learned the mother of four children at the center of a Green Bay Amber Alert back in February is now being charged with several felonies. Brittany Schmidt has been covering this story from the very beginning. She walked us through the criminal complaint and the charges Deanna Ward is now facing. Hours after authorities issued an early morning Amber Alert on February 9th for four kids missing in Green Bay, they were found in Upper Michigan with a relative. Brown County's Child Protective Services took the kids ages 1 to 7 into protective custody. Authorities questioned the children's mother, Deanna Ward, but never criminally charged her until this week when authorities filed this criminal complaint and ordered her to appear in court on August 6th. Action 2 News talked to Ward shortly after the Amber Alert was canceled. She reached out to us and in an interview in February, she says she was confused and didn't know the police were looking for her kids. I want people to know my, I just didn't leave my kids or take off with my kids and kidnap them and it wasn't like how they made it out to be. Like they made it like I was just like a suspect and my kids missing and in this criminal complaint investigators and child protective services document all the times they say they reached out to ward before the amber alert was issued it includes several phone calls text messages and in-person conversations authorities say she misled them several times in february ward told us that she told police where the kids were with her mother in Upper Michigan. Everybody knew where they were. They weren't missing. But documents show she didn't give officials exact locations or details. According to the complaint, police learned of a Facebook message on February 7th where Deanna told her mother, quote, you are absolutely not allowed to allow the kids to be in the presence of any workers or cops. Even if they seem like they are on your side, trust me, they are not. It's all an act. IDC, what you have to do to keep them away, but it has to be done, end quote. Ward is now facing four felony counts of interfering with custody beyond visitation and two counts of obstructing an officer. She is also charged with four counts of chronic neglect of a child. When authorities brought the children back to Wisconsin, they were evaluated by an expert with Willow Tree Child Advocacy Center and Children's Hospital of Wisconsin. The expert documented concerns involving drug endangerment, medical neglect, dental neglect, and physical abuse concerns. In the complaint, officials say drug tests from February for two of the children, ages four and six, came back positive for methamphetamine. In Brown County, Brittany Schmidt, Action 2 News.